welcome to the third international science e conference. I'm um, uh, Adauda Rifkatu Samaila, working in College of Nursing and Midwifery, Gombe, Nigeria. Uh, I'm presenting on a topic assessment on managerial associated with intra intra contraceptive device among women attending ED Ogongon Primary Health Care Center. Ibadan North Nigeria, local government area of Oyo State, Nigeria. The next. The next. Next slide. Next slide, sir. I'm having an issue with the next slide. Um, introduction. A heavy cyclical a menstruation bleeding over several con consecutive cycles is known as menageria, menageria, and it is a common health problem affecting nearly one third of women on some part of uh, uh, a point of during their reproductive years and causing distress and ill health in women world, according to the chat the Intel 2004. Hysterectomy is the main treatment for menageria. But there are another methods that is used for the treatment of manaregia. That is the use of levonorgestrel. Here, the next slide, please. I'm having challenges with the next slide. So let me continue. What I am saying is that women presently now they don't consider the, the using hysterectomy uh, uh, as a treatment. Because hysterectomy is a, a, a is a process whereby where the uterus is being removed. When the uterus is removed, the woman loses her her beauty, loses her interest, and she feels she is not a woman. Therefore, they prefer to take treatment, take drugs. That is by the use of medical treatment to to enable them um, to enable them get well. I'm having challenges with the slides. So I'm moving to talk, despite the fact that there is a, a network problem that is preventing me from moving to the next slide, but it, it has not stopped me from uh, presenting my paper. Here, what I want to say here is that, so women prepare to, to, to take treatment instead of removal of the uterus, that is hysterectomy. The next slide, please. I'm having issues with the next slide. So. Yeah, yeah, that is what I am saying. I have already said this one. I, I want to move to the, to the next slide. So what I am saying here is that uh, uh, manaregia is a problem, is a, an issue. And who estimated that approximately 160 million women worldwide use IUCD? And in the China, they estimated two thirds of these users, and 96 million, only a small percentage of foreign users are in Eastern and Western Europe or other utilized in the country. In Nigeria, IUCD is being used. Why? Because when there is no much problem, the woman st spend up to 10 years to 12 years before she will come back to the hospital for removal. Unless if there is this problem of manaregia then it will make the woman it will make the woman not uh, to continue with the treatment the next slide please so a statement of my problem here is that the aim of this study is to assess the manaregia associated with intrauterine contraceptive devices among the women attending Ogungun primary school primary uh, health care center ibadan North local government area of uh, Oyo State of Nigeria. You know, in, in Manaregia, it, it, it happens women face a lot of problems. They face, uh, it, it, when the uterus is being removed, they will face infertility. And other problems are dysmenorrhea, lower abdominal pain, female urinary incontinency, and in, increasingly uh, the main cause of the death uh, in the Western country because. When there is menorrhagia, you know menorrhagia is the excessive bleeding. 
when they are bleeding, the heart will lose its strength and thereby circulation of blood will be prevented. Thereby, the woman will find herself in mobility or mortality rate. Yes. So, uh, the, the, the use of IUCD, it has advantage and disadvantages. The advantages are highly effective. It is highly effective, as I have said earlier. It probably prevents against uh, uh, endometrial uh, cancer. Adopted uh, contraceptive technology has been brought up. And the disadvantage is that spontaneous expulsion can occur. When there is heavy bleeding, uh, the, 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 the IUCD can come out. The loss of strength. We used to tell them that after insertion, they should be feeling the strength after menstruation or when they enter into the bathroom. The ID risks of insertion. I'm not saying that IUCD can cause pelvic inflammatory diseases. What I am saying is that uh, the, 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 when there is PID the, and, and, and IUCD is inserted, it can increase the risk of pelvic inflammatory diseases. And it does not prevent HIV or STI. Uh, the theoretical conceptual framework that was used on this uh, uh, research is that I, I, I use concept of health belief. We know health belief uh, helps in, in, in looking around the physical, the psychological, and the motive attitude behavior of a client or patient. It comprises of the perceived susceptibility, how the client perceives perceive the health problem that is facing or she is facing, personally relevant or that diagnosis of illness in accurate, uh, in this study, it refers to manoradia associated with IUCD. Another point is that perceived severity, how the client perceives the severity of the disease condition that comes to them. They recognize personal susceptibility. No action will be taken unless they face challenges. When the condition is serious, then you will see them trooping and coming for, to, 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 to solve their problem, whereas the complication has already occurred. Are you with me? Yes. Passive benefits. If there is, this refers to the patient belief that giving treatment will, will cure the illness or help prevent the, the diseases, the rush to, to, to take treatment, perceive barriers. Barriers can occur to weak health, belief, health, uh, health providers. It can occur to the neighbors or friends. One example that I want to give is that I cancel a client. She opt for IUCD for me to, to take her to the insertion room and insert it. She said no. When she saw her friend, her friend just came in and tell her something. I don't know what she has said. Later she said, no, she's not taking it because her friend has discouraged her. Modifying factors. The modifying factors are the psycho, uh, psycho demographic factors, age, gender, education, income, personality, variables, and patient satisfaction indirectly influence health-related behavior. Motivation. Motivation, we, the health providers, we are to be the source of motivation. We should motivate our clients to move, to come, to comply with the treatment. Yes. Result and data analysis. The result of data analysis, it was analyzed using descriptive st statistics of frequency counts, percentage, uh, and the results presented in table and charts. Infre inferential statistics of CASCA test and, 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 and the test was used to test the hypothesis formulated at the significant level of 0 0.05. The distribution of respond, uh, respondents was highly represented. It was highlighted. It, is, it come to the notice that the women attending, uh, um, attending uh, uh, respondents, uh, uh, they, they are at the age of 25 to 29 years. And we found out that 50% were married women, 35% were singles, 23% were separated. Next slide, please. Yes, and the 4% were divorced, 2% were widows, 
Christianity is the dominant uh, religion of that uh, 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 respondent. Uh, 54, we are Christian, and 46, we are Islam. Majority respondents were traders, 34%. And the 23% were uh, artisans, 21% were professionals, 2% were all employed, 10% were private. Uh, they were privately employed as shown in the table. Most of the respondent husbands uh, completed secondary school education, of which I rate our 43%. 23%, uh, 20% had primary and tertiary education. Then 17% respondent husband has no formal education. Next. So when we look at their level of education, they are not well educated well that they can understand what the health providers are saying effectively. Unless the health providers has to take a serious action and be serious in their work, then the work will move on according to how it's supposed to be. Next. I'm having challenges with uh, the Yorubas. The Yorubas are the more dominant language in, in, the, in, in, the, in, the, in the in the in the research which I had. Yorubas were 64%, Igbos were 14%, and 8% were houses. Most of the respondents married within the age of 19 to 24 years. 33% got married at the age of 25 to, 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 nine, to 29%. Ranges 11% within 30 to 34 age range. 8% 8 got married above 35 years as highlighted in the table. Most of the respondents, 32 years, uh, which is 33%, have two children. 21%, three children. 16%, a respondent, one children, one child. The result for the further shown financial situation of this respondent. 32% of the respondents had the income, uh, had uh, no income, and 30% earned 11,000, 20,000 naira. 22% earned less than 5,000. The 9% earned between 21,000 and 40,000. Neither while only 7% of the respondents earn 40,000 naira. So we, when we look at their level of earning, it is not enough for them to cater for their problems. Next. So in summary, when we look at uh, how these studies is going, it reveals that the respondent has poor knowledge treatment perception about monorrhagia associated with intrauterine contraceptive device. However, necessary steps to be taken to implement programs that educate mothers on this poor knowledge. More so, education and sensitization program will assist immediately in reducing the rate of mortality as a result of inappropriate attention to the women. Therefore, uh, health workers have a lot to do in order to make sure that uh, this problem is resolved. Next slide. So, next slide. So, uh, I, I recommend that government at the local, state, federal level should make necessary provision that will increase the well-being of the mothers in Nigeria. Policy makers should create the law of which every woman will have Three family planning methods. Mass uh, mobilization of the public on the causes and effect of malaria among the mothers. So the government at the local government level should partner to create more awareness at the grassroots and partnership to involve faith-based organization and traditional uh, traditional uh, uh, leaders. Okay. So suggestions. I suggest that similar studies should be carried out in other local government areas among the mother. This should be excluded by joint efforts from the government and non-governmental in order to generate effective and presentable results. Conclusion. In, it can also be said that lack of proper in, in intervention by the healthcare centers and family planning providers contributed to the low knowledge and poor perception among mothers 
at Idi Ogungu Primary Health Care Center if I do not LGA for your state of Nigeria. These are my reference, the Anderson, the, the Badrans, and the Ploma Child PD, Townsend, that is my reference. I want to thank you very much for uh, 